But you were born with mischief in your eyes and fire in your veins. Hey guys, welcome back to Top 5 Wednesday. Top 5 Wednesday was created by Ginger Reads Lady, and I will link the Goodreads group and her channel down below, as always. So, this week's topic is, uh, books you did not finish, or DNF'd. Um, the thing is, for me, is that I've only ever DNF'd one book. So, I decided that because I really like doing these, that I was going to do, uh, fully DNF'd, or wanted to DNF. So, let's just get into it. The first one I have is the book that I did DNF. I got probably 50 pages into it, and I just couldn't do it anymore. It was not the kind of thing I liked, and it was very strange for me because it's about vampires and werewolves and all that other stuff. But that is Classic Tales of Vampires and Shapeshifters by Tig Thomas. This book was just... Not what I was expecting. I was expecting a lot cooler stories in it, and it was just bad. I couldn't get through it. I had to DNF it. After that is one that I actually just wrapped up in uh, October, but that is Days of Blood and Starlight by Lady Taylor. I mentioned in my review for this that I wanted to DNF it so many times. It was just so slow, but I pushed myself through it. Um, I wanted to put Dreams of God's Monsters on here, but I haven't even started it yet. I have a feeling that that's going to be another one that I kind of want to DNF, but I'm going to push myself through it again. I don't like DNFing things. I would rather push myself through it. After that is an e-arc that I also just wrapped up with, and that is Banished Sons of Poseidon by Andrew J. Peters. This book was just incredibly slow. I, it just wasn't for me. I thought it would be, it sounded really interesting. The plot would be really interesting, but at the same time, it was just really slow. After that, I have... Jarek by Stephen Brust. I wanted to DNF this book so many times. It was incredibly slow, but I pushed myself through it, and I ended up really enjoying the end of it, as well as the fact that I enjoyed the sequel a lot more than I enjoyed this one. So this is a case of I'm glad I didn't DNF it because I really ended up enjoying it. Yeah. And the final one is another e-arc that I got, actually, and that is Shattered Blue by Lauren Burt Horowitz. This was, again, just incredibly slow. The whole entire time I was reading it, I was like, is it over yet? Is it done with yet? Um, yeah. I mean, it was like up and down and up and down and up and down, and just... Ugh. I wasn't drawn to it fully. But... That is all for this video. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, everyone. Cause you were born with mischief in your eyes.